Hello, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you a pretty useful function in Clo 3D. Attach to measure. I often forgot about this tool because I don't see it in the 3D window toolbar. If that's the case for you as well, simply go to top window toolbar. Under settings. User settings. User interface and turn on group tools. Back to the 3D window toolbar. Now I can see edit measurement and all the measurement tools. There are two types of measurement tools. Avatar and garment. In this video, I am only focusing on the measurement for avatar. By the way, if you like to keep the tools ungrouped for your 3D window, you can still find this measurement function from the top window toolbar under avatar. The purpose of this function is to make sure your garment is placed on the correct position on avatar. For example, when you are making a shirt with collar, it has a tendency to lean toward the back. To keep the shoulder in the right spot, you can use this function. First, decide which segment line you want to attach to avatar. In this case, it will be the shoulder seams. Find out the length of the shoulder seam. Go to 3D window toolbar and find avatar measurement. Select basic tape measure. Your garment will become transparent in 3D window. Click a point to start a measurement line where you want the new shoulder seam to be on the avatar. Double click to end the line. Go back to 3D window toolbar under edit measure. Click attach to measure. Click on the shoulder seam then click the new measurement line and simulate. You can see the shoulder seam will be attached to the new line. Use edit measure to revise measurement line location and length. Once it's done, use edit measure, right click on the line and select duplicate to symmetric position to finish the other side of the shoulder seam. Attach the seam to the measurement line and simulate. And this is how you use the function. As you can see, once the segment line attached to avatar, it will hold the garment in place. This can be quite useful when you want to keep your garment staying in the same spot on avatar especially during animation. I created this outfit with a deep V neckline. And here is how it looks in animation without any attachment. The garment ended up falling off the shoulder on the left side. Now let me use attach to measure on the shoulders. And here is the runway result. Looks pretty good right? You can use the same method on an unbuttoned open front jacket. However, if you have another layer of garment underneath the jacket, you won't be able to use attach to measure. You will have to use tack function instead. Attach to measure also works very well on strapless style of garment. Make sure to create a segment line or use existing line on the pattern, and know the length of the line. So you can create a measurement line on avatar in the same length. Once the the segment line is attached to the avatar, you can start adjust the fit of the garment. One thing you should know. If you make any cut on the pattern piece, you will lose the attachment. And you will have to reattach again. There are other tape measure options you can use. Such as surface tape measure when you want to create curve lines. Or basic circumference measure is good for attaching waistband.
Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click like and subscribe.